Right. Portmore will, won't make it that easy for them, however. Because they'll be freshest. Or most fresh. Too often, a little bit too often for Dudley Bernard's liking, so... Well, they are in the attacking third now. Rousseau again. Adding to those numbers. Yeah, collecting that one deep. Now this is Gavin Burton. Misplaced pass from him. And Walsh sends it. Quite read him. Not the first time Daly has given up possession cheaply. For Harbourview. And he's Marshall on his left foot. We know he can drive it from distance. Joseph was trying to get in there as well. Yeah, but good play from Portmore. They're really turning up now in this game. Winning the ball higher. I was about to... Surely. Yeah, finally get some. Not a lot of movement off the ball by Harborview. And it's a throw to Portmore United in the end. Try as he might, Daly was trying to keep it for himself for a while, but he, he had a little support. Game feels a little stretched. Marshall with the, the pace there will get to the end of this one. He has Brack. Opportunity for Hub of you. Priestley. Needs to get his passing right this afternoon. And uh, mm. would have won the Manning Cup and the All Ireland Championship, the Olivia Shield, with not the very early stages of 2022. Lovely touch inside. <laughs> Trying to get Marshall involved. Harborview defending stubbornly. Referee says play on. It's Walls! Oh! The woodwork. Romario Palmer in the Harborview goal did not even see it. Yeah, love to see him play with that smile on his face. Mischievous in his look, in his demeanor when he's on the ball as well. He's got there. He has company. Up of you defense on that occasion. Poor United, they don't mind it. They just managed to put that one across the line, and it's what. Maybe they are hungry for it. Pum United with the lead. Alvina Smyers, who has been a threat down that right hand side, here he is again. Yep. But once it broke for him, it was a real. He knows how to make those runs inside the box. Harding skips by one challenge. Well, Anglin needs to be careful here. Harding lost it. Well, back to where we started. Shake things up a bit from a hub of you standpoint. They have been making some silly mistakes at the back. Not that they would be out of sight, but they certainly didn't, didn't expect to be level with the Joseph to yep. whip this one in. Yep, five players to aim for. And uh, Dyer heading it away back to Joseph. Oh, nicely done by Rose trying to get by a second player. Don't think that was necessary. 
lovely back heel. Felt as if we were transported to the favelas for a second there. But no. Go in, Austin. Lester Joseph. Young. Joseph. Referee Odette Hamilton just making sure everything is in order. It isn't at the moment. Anglin and Joseph at it. Here it comes. Comes out to Anglin. His shot is blocked. Hopeful ball over the top. Miscued. It's with Walsh. Can he finish? Of course he can. And just moments after Harbour View had spurned a breakaway, it's Portmore United. Yeah, I was mentioned before that O'Shane Staple is on the left-hand side. He's usually operating on the right-hand side, of course. Yeah, ended up dragging that one. Still an opportunity for Harbour View. Brackenridge doing enough. Yeah, and Harbour View, they just managed to clear. We're hearing that seven minutes of stoppages will be played. If he's on the end of it. Wasn't quite on the end of it. Need that one across to Marshall. Cross the staple now. Burton, I think he's probably run out of gas. McFarlane now for Portman United. They just managed to clear their lines, Portman United. Helter Skelter inside the own penalty area. That's it. That's the end of 